Part one of Sleepaway. Hey, honey. Hey, dad. Where's your sister? She's out there on the swing. Quinlan, get in here. What the? Yes, dad, what do you need? Sit down for a second, Quinlan. What did I do? Nothing, but I have to talk to you too. Okay. Well, you know how I have to go to Miami for that work trip, right? Yeah, aren't you supposed to be gone all summer? Yep, and I can't find anyone to look after you. So we're gonna be home alone? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, you're so funny, Quinlan. No. You guys are going to be going away as well. We're coming to Miami? No, Katie. Okay, so what's even going on? You're going to sleepaway camp. Well, what? Yeah, for the whole summer. Won't it be fun? I said, won't it be fun? No. I wanted to play with my friends all summer. Yeah, I was planning on seeing mine, and now I have to go to some random camp. Oh, you'll be fine. Oh, uh, one more thing. What? Hey, you're kind of leaving tomorrow. What? You didn't give us any time to prepare for this. You'll be fine, but... I recommend you go pack. Bye. Sleepaway camp? I don't want to go to the silly sleepaway camp. Yeah, me either. Well, uh, maybe it's not the worst thing in the world. I guess there's only one way to find out, because we don't have a say in this. Two. That's really annoying. Wait, where's Toby going to go? He's going to Grandma's. He'll be fine. Grandma? Yeah. Why couldn't we go to Grandma's? Oh. I didn't think of that. Well, you're already registered. Go pack. See we see. The next morning. Rise and shine. Camp is waiting. Can't camp wait for five more minutes? Uh, it's too early for this. Just get out of bed and put your clothes on. Wear the matching outfits you guys have. Our matching outfits? Why? Yeah, what's the point of that? Because it'll look cool. Now, come on. We don't have all day. Well, we've got our clothes on and we're all packed. Perfect. Are you ready to... I'm not going to camp! Quinlan! Get your stuff. Let's get in the car. You're lucky this time. Is this the right- Oh, goodbye! Okay, I guess we just go in. Oh, no. Hey, welcome to Camp Sunshine! Is that- My Mr. Clipper! No, not Mr. Clipper! Mr. Clipper, what are you doing here? Why, I'm the camp counselor! Oh, goody. Go put your stuff in the bedroom, will ya? Okay. Hey, guys, what's up? My name's Quinlan, and I don't want to be here. Quinlan? No, I get what she means. Nobody wants to be here. Yeah, I mean, we're at Mr. Clipper's camp. I don't want to be stuck with Mr. Clipper all summer. Well, our dad actually told us about the camp on the way here, and it actually sounds not too bad. But, like, what did he tell you? He told us that, like, we swim in the lake, we play games with each other, uh, we sing songs, we... I think you heard wrong things. Yeah. What are you talking about? This camp is supposed to be really bad. Especially since it's run by Mr. Clipper. Apparently, creepy things happen here. Any kid who's went here for a whole summer has never returned the same. They all go crazy. There are reports of them seeing things after they come back. And apparently, it's not fun at all. Oh! Well, anyway. Well, anyway. You can just put your bags in that bin. Okay. They all go in here. Well, what are we going to do now? Dinner! Well, maybe dinner will be good. Who likes it? What is this? Bertney and Broccoli! Yummy. Okay, well, we're gonna have to deal with two months just of this. That's not fun. You eating it? Ah! Yeah, that <laughs> After dinner. Well, that was disgusting. And we have to deal with this for the rest of the summer. Whatever, let's just go to bed. Nighty night! Oh, uh, what are you doing? Sorry, I'm just gonna go to bed. <laughs> Good night. We're here. Part three of Sleep Away. Don't know why I said it like that. We're here. Okay, let's wake these guys up. Get up! Whoa, 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 whoa. Who are you? Oh, I'm glad you asked. My name is Shelly. What are you? What are you talking about? Actually, I think the most important question right now is why are you here? No, the most important question is why are you wearing Christmas pajamas in the middle of summer? Hey, my grandma made these. Anyway, as we said before, I'm Shelly. I'm Lucy! Okay. But we need to warn you. Warn us about this camp! We are the ghosts of Camp Sunshine. Ghosts? Oh my gosh. I think I'm gonna pass out. Don't freak out, child. We used to be campers at this camp, just like you. You did? Yep. And we just came to warn you that this camp is not fun. In about a day or two, Mr. Clipper is gonna send you guys out on a wilderness survival trip. Wilderness survival? Yeah, he's gonna make you guys sleep in the forest by yourself. This doesn't sound that fun. Oh, but it gets worse. Oh my gosh, what's happening? That's when people start to go missing. Missing? Excuse me. Like us. We went missing. What the? I know, shocker. We're right here, though, so it's fine. You found us. Congratulations. This is not helping me. I'm, I'm still freaking out. 
anyway. We're just warning you to all stick together. And if you can, avoid that wilderness trip. There are other bad things that happen on that too, but this is all the information we can give you. What do you mean there's more bad things? Yeah, what's stopping you from telling us? Well, uh, gotta run. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see that? Yeah, what just happened? Wilderness survival? Maybe they're lying. Maybe this is a dream. I'm dreaming, I'm dreaming. Let's just, let's just go back to bed. And like, maybe it'll be a dream. Maybe I'm just having this dream. It's, uh, yeah, maybe it's weird. Yeah, okay, everyone back to bed. The next morning. Ah, <sighs> whoa. What's up? I just had the craziest dream last night. Well, Willie, me too. So did I. Same. Me as well. I did too. Same. Yeah, I had this dream that, like, these two ghosts came and warned everyone about this camp. What? Okay, so that was most definitely not a dream. It wasn't a dream? Yeah, no, we were all there. Shelly and Lucy. Will there survival? A few days. We have to avoid it and stick together. And worse things happen, but they can't tell us what they are. Oh my gosh, I'm totally freaking out right now. <laughs> we're all gonna die. Okay, okay, calm down. We'll think of a plan. Yeah, but we got it. Breakfast time, everybody. Let's go. Oh no. He's luring us in with food. Come on, guys. Let's just get dressed and go. And I don't know. We'll find out what happens. Okay, at least the breakfast is somewhat normal. Yeah, grapes and waffles. I like this. Yeah, this doesn't seem too bad. After breakfast. Well, that was pretty good. Yeah, I'm surprised. Hey, guys. You like the food? Uh, yeah. Just one question, though. How come dinner last night we got burnt meat and broccoli and now we get, like, really good food? Oh, it's because the chef made breakfast. He wasn't here yesterday, so I made dinner. Clearly. What? I said, uh... Yippee! Anyway, I have something to tell you guys. Okay. So I have a really fun activity for you all. Part four of Sleepaway. Sorry, I forgot. I have a big activity planned for you guys. Part four of Sleepaway. Sorry, I forgot. I have a big activity planned for you guys. Ah! Uh, uh, Mr. Mr. Clipper, sir? Yes? Before you tell us, we, um, we have to, uh, we have to go down to the soccer field. Why do you- Hello? Okay, so he's literally bringing us to wilderness survival right now. Our life is over! No, it isn't. We just have to stick together. Try and avoid the trip at all costs. I don't know how we'll do that, but try. And we will stick together. Yeah, we're not gonna let a single person out of our sight. Hey, guys. Ah! What? I was just wondering if I could play soccer with you guys. I love soccer. It's my favorite sport. Oh! Uh, yeah, of, of course you can. We're always looking for more people. Are you guys crazy? He might be a serial killer. Come join in the fun. Awesome, let's play. One hour later. Ha <laughs> ha, another goal for Mr. Clipper. <laughs> Are you a rat, son? It looks like you got something on your mind. No, 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 sir. You look like you're panicking about something. <laughs> no? Hmm. <laughs> I think you just need a little rest. Everyone head back to the cabin. We're going to have an hour of quiet time. Yes, Mr. Clipper. And then I'm going to tell you all the big surprise. What's the matter with you guys? Okay, 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 okay. So he's gonna... He's gonna bring us out there. What do we do? I think we don't think about it at all right now. Because maybe, maybe it's not even... Maybe it's not even bad. Or maybe... I don't know. Maybe those people were trying to prank us. <laughs> yeah, how could those people know anything, right, guys? They, they don't even go here. <laughs> yeah. They, they don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh. So, um, let's play a game. How about we play hairdressers? Hairdressers is fun. Yeah, hairdressers. I'll be the hairdresser first. I also brought my board game along with me in case anyone wants to play that instead. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I think I'll do that. Me too. Let, let the little kids play hairdressers. As time went on, they actually started to forget about Mr. Clipper and his plan. Come on, come on. Three, are you serious? Uh-oh, looks like you have to go back. This dice is trying to mess with me. Hello, Miss Sweeney. Welcome to the hair salon. Hi, I was hoping I could get my hair dyed, please. Just come right this way. Okay, thank you. Hello, lady. Would you like your hair dyed purple? Yeah, sure. You're just pretending, though, right? Obviously, I'm not gonna color your hair. <laughs> <gasps> oh, no. I just remembered something. Mr. Clipper and the trip. Um, huh? What? What's wrong? Hello, it's time to do the other side. <laughs> I like being the annoying customer. It's funny. I know. I get to be the annoying one next. Are you okay? <gasps> Uh, hey, what's wrong? Yeah, did I do something? I, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings if I did. Yeah, come on, just tell us. Wilderness twip. Oh. What the? Are you guys okay? Uh-uh. What's going on? Yeah, what's wrong? Wilderness twip. I forgot about that. Time for your surprise, everybody! Ah! Part five, I'm filming this in my closet. And it's allergy season, so my voice sounds really congested and stuffed. I'm sorry about that. Ah, we're gonna die! No, we're not. Don't worry, don't panic. 
It'll be fine, I think. So, uh, um, anyway, I have something for you all. What? They're all in this box. Find your size and try them on. What's going on? Just do it. Five minutes later. Um, what are we wearing? Those are your Camp Sunshine uniforms. You're gonna need those. Why do we need to wear these exactly? Because you're going on a special trip. Oh, no, 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 no. It's a wilderness survival trip. Ah! And you need those uniforms so people know where you're from, in case you get lost. Don't you dare bring us on that trip! Well, sorry, but you kind of have to go. We were never informed about this, mister. Yes, you were. It said on the website, Wilderness Survival Training. It did not! Oh, well, even if it didn't, you're still going. Don't worry, it's only three nights. Are you crazy? Are you kidding me? Three nights in the wilderness with absolutely no training whatsoever. Exactly! You're crazy, man. Oh, thank you. I need someone to hold the main bag and the safety kit. You two, thanks. What? Oh, also, you're all gonna need a mat to sleep on, so grab one on your way out. There they arrive. Well, this looks fun, doesn't it? See you guys in a few days. Well, I guess we're here now. Oh, that's just wonderful. And the sun's going down right now. Oh, my gosh. Okay, you know what? Everyone just don't panic. Yeah, we got this. Yeah, what they said. Well, first of all, I'm starving because we barely ate anything today. Yeah, let me see what Mr. Clipper packed us for food. Are you kidding me? What? What do you give us? Dog food and seeds. And some water. What? Are you crazy? The only edible thing there are the seeds. I guess we should save them till we're like, will we indeed, right? I guess so. But hey, look at this. He also gave us a light, which is good. Oh yeah, that goes perfect. Maybe we should just all go to bed and try and get this night over with. Yeah, true. Yeah, everyone grab a mat. I guess this isn't too bad. Yeah, I might actually be pretty comfy here. Are you serious? Why does it have to wane right now? Could this get any worse? All right, that's it. I'm gonna go find something for shelter or something. Why does it have to be raining right now? Are you kidding me? Huh? What the? Well, I guess I can take them. Did you find anything? Well, yes, but not for shelter. Huh? What'd you find? I don't know, a lantern and some Girl Scout uniform. That's weird. Hey, the lantern works. You could keep it as some kind of backup light. Yeah, but whose uniform is this? Why is it just out here? I don't know. I think we should just go to bed, though. Yeah, try not to think about it. It might be nothing. Yeah, maybe some Girl Scouts were just, like, walking around here, and then, uh, someone dropped their uniform. Maybe. They all go to sleep. And the sun comes up. Well, that was an uncomfortable night. I know. And what are these mats made out of? I don't right. It feels like straw. Yeah, that was really uncomfortable. And my clothes got all wet. Worst sleep ever. What about you, Quidlin? Quidlin? There is Quidlin. Part six. Part six. Where is Quinlan? I don't know. Everyone put your mats away now. Okay, so obviously there's a person missing here. And that cannot be good. What do we do? What do we do? What do we... Guys! Uh, was that her? I think so. Quinlan! Quinlan, where are you? Guys, I'm over here. Quinlan! Oh my gosh, there you are. What happened to you? <sighs> Basically, I saw this shiny gold thing, and I, I don't know. I thought it could be something, like... To get us out of here? There's something I don't really know. We've been finding a lot of weird stuff lately and keeping it. So I thought I'd grab this. Okay, but why are you crying? What happened? Yeah, you see that huge log? I tripped over this branch and now my arm hurts a lot. Oh dear. Well, come on. So we'll grab the first aid kit Mr. Clipper packed. You okay, Quinlan? I'm fine. Just hurt myself. What are you holding? I don't know exactly. It looks pretty and shiny. We should hang on to it. Yeah, you're right. I'm putting it right here. With the mats. Okay, I've got the medical kit. Let's see here. Well, it does just seem like you bruised it. Oh, well, it hurts a lot. Someone make it stop. Here, uh, Mr. Clipper packed some painkillers. Take some water. And here's the pill. Thank you. Okay. Well, at least that's over. Yeah, but what are we gonna do now? We cannot survive any longer here. We don't even have that much food. I know. I'm just gonna go on a walk around. I'll come too. I didn't even know they had a lake here. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I wish I never signed up for this camp. Me too. Uh Wait a second, what is that in the water? What? Oh, I have no idea. Oh my gosh. What? Get the other campers now. Why? What? Just get them. Okay. Guys. Stella, Stella, hola, clap, 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 sing it. Guys! Whoa, what are you in a rush for? Yeah, who died? No one died, but come with me. Why? I don't know, and bring that shiny thingy you found. This? Yes, let's go. What's going on with her? Whoa, I never knew there was a lake down here. Yeah, that's cool. How about look? Look at that shiny thing. It looks like it connects to yours. Oh yeah, it does. But it's all the way down there. How are we gonna- Cannonball! Um, you good? Uh, I'm good. Look, I got it. I'm coming back up. Wait for me. Okay, should we just put the two pieces together? Yeah, sure. See what happens. Nothing happened. Waste of time. Wait, no, guys, look. The waterfall is gone. Whoa. I'm gonna see what's down there. Oh, it's a crystal. What happens if I touch it? 
Ah! Where did she go? That's it, I'm touching the crystal. Help me too. Guys, stop! Me three! Quinlan, don't you dare! Go! Ah, Quinlan! Come with me, kid, we're touching that rock. Wait for us! Go! Oh, thank gosh, you guys are all here and you're all right. Yeah, but where's here? Like, where are we? I think we're in a train station. A train station? We touched a rock! Yeah, but it doesn't look like there's anybody here. Hello? Hello? Anybody here? Anybody? Hello? Um, okay, yeah. Nobody is here. Okay, that's weird. But, however, uh, seeing as we haven't eaten for 24 hours because Mr. Clipper gave us dog food, there's a food stand with freshly made food. Again, no one's there, but, I mean, we could go for a snack. We may as well. Part seven. Seven, right? That's part seven? Yeah, part seven. Well, let's just get the food. We have nothing else to do. Yeah, follow me. Whoa, okay, there's definitely a lot of food here. And I mean, no one's here to stop us, so grab as much as you want. Also, I really don't think we need this anymore, so I'm just gonna, like, leave it there. They all grabbed some food. Wow, that was delicious. Much better than burnt meat and broccoli. Or dog food. Well, come on, guys. Let's just go see what else we could find. Yeah, I still don't even know where we are exactly. Well, I'm pretty sure I saw an elevator. Let's go over there. All right. There's one other floor, so it looks like we're going down. Whoa. This looks like where the actual train leaves. Train to Vox Valley leaving now. Hey, that's where we live. Yeah, guys, let's get on the train. We can get out of here. Yeah, come on, before it leaves. We made it! Um, did anyone check if there's anyone on this train? No, why? Well, we're moving, so there must be. I'm gonna go check. Ah! Keep it down, would you? We're trying to do a crossword. Why are you guys back? Those ghost people are back? Well, you do know how we are the campers who went missing. Yeah? We went missing the exact same way you did. What? Ah! Oh no, no, no! We're never gonna make it back! Let me finish! Okay. Once you get back, you're gonna have to go into this house. However, it's not a normal house. It's like a escape wound kind of thing. Okay. And the only reason we never made it back is because we couldn't solve it. Just like we can't solve this crossword. Shelly, stop talking! Escape room? Why are you still here? Sorry, just gonna talk to the driver? Oh, no. So, guys... Yeah, we heard about the escape room. Yeah, but there's another thing that you probably didn't hear. What? There's no one driving this train. Um, how are we moving then? I don't know. I wish I did. Wait, look. Guys, we stopped. Come on, let's get off. Well, seeing as this is the only house in the city, I'm assuming we're here. Okay. This is interesting. Hey, what does that note say? Let me see. Check mailbox one for what you need. It's bound to be your starting key. Hey, look. It's an actual key. Oh, well, what does it unlock? Let me try this door. No, nothing. Try the other one. Okay. Whoa, it worked. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go. Part eight. That was an eight, by the way. Let's go in. Whoa, it's a child. Hey, are you okay? Hello? Are you alive? Um, I don't think that's a real person. Hang on, let me test something. Well, I'm poking him with the key and nothing's happening, so... Yep, okay. We are the only ones in this universe. Place, whatever you want to call this after all. Yeah. Also, guys, why is that area fenced off? It's probably the next level or something. But what are we supposed to do right now? Wait, I think I see something. It's another letter. Well, go on, read it. The baby can't sleep, find out why, and you'll be out of here in no time. What? All right, let me handle this. Listen, kid, we just came from Camp Sunshine, and if you don't go to sleep, we're gonna be stuck in this universe forever, so go to bed! Hello, I said go to bed, or me and you are gonna have some problems. Okay, no, I don't think that's working. Let me try something. Hey, kid, I see you have this bottle. You want some milk? Okay, go to sleep now. Are you kidding me? Well, guys, that didn't work. Hang on. This maraca is really loud. It makes loud noise. Look, I'm getting rid of it, because maybe it's keeping you up in your sleep or something. There, it's gone. Go to sleep. I said go to sleep. He's not going to sleep. Are you guys serious right now? The reason he can't sleep is because you guys aren't turning off the light. Watch and learn. Ah, what's happening to the teddy bear? Um, his teddy bear's a demon. What's going on with it? Wait, that's probably why he can't sleep. Because he's scared of the bear. Yeah, get rid of the bear. Okay. Sorry, Mr. Bear, you have to go now. Guys, look, it worked. Yes. <gasps> Another key. It probably unlocks the next level. Awesome, we made it, and now we still have more to do. Hey, but at least we got somewhere. Yeah, you're smart for figuring that out. Thanks, guys. Well, I guess we don't need this anymore. I'll read the next letter. Someone in here does not belong. Find out who and move along. What? She doesn't belong. What? I don't know, I'm just guessing. Okay, well, that's just great. Maybe there are clues in here. Like, look, a magnifying glass. I literally can't see anything. Open the fridge. 
Um, a pizza box, some bread, some beets, a broken glass, and a bunch of spray paint. Okay, maybe the clue's somewhere in the baby's room. True, we have the whole house, other than the locked parts. So by the whole house, you mean the other room. Yeah, but it won't hurt to go look. You're right, three people come with me. I'll come, me too. Wait for me. Hmm, maybe this has something to do with it? Let me look at it up close. Maybe there's something hidden in the letter. Hmm. Do, do, do. <gasps> Guys! What? Look, one of these spray paints is different. It has a no ghost symbol on it. Spray it! Yeah, maybe that'll do something. Okay. Here goes. Ah! Whoa, is that a skeleton? Yeah, I think so. Um, I don't like the sound of that. Well, hey, look, the fence is gone. You're right, let's go. Well, this certainly is a creepy challenge. Tell me about it. Here's the next letter. Happy birthday, here's a cake. Make a wish for your life's sake. Um, so we have to make a wish to get us out of here? Or at least to whatever level that is. Um, I got this one. Cake I wish for to get out of here. Part nueve. Part nine. I wish for to get out of here. Maybe you need to light the candles. Yeah. How old are you? Um, can you not tell? I'm literally six. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, does anyone have a lighter? Why would any of us be carrying a lighter? I don't know. Well, we kind of need a lighter to light the candle. Maybe we can wish without the candle? Yeah, let me try. I wish to go to the next level, please. The next level. Please. Please! Didn't work. Yeah, I saw that. Um, okay, this is difficult. Does anyone have a birthday coming up? Oh, I do. Mine's really, really close. Like, practically in a week. When is it? December. What? It's May. Oh, yeah. May 17th. Huh? It's May 17th. One, seven. Look, the candles went up. You're right. Oh, yeah, I guess we would have to do whatever day it is. Make the wish, come on. I wish to get to the next level. Hey, look, the key. But how do I unlock this exactly? I don't know, just put the key in. Okay. Huh. Didn't know logic worked like that. Everyone up here. Open these gifts all the way. One of them will save the day. Um, okay. Let's get opening, I guess. You guys stay down there because it's really crowded. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Wow, a baseball. What is this? Guys, the key. Well, that was really fast. Yeah, I at least want to see what's in mine. Oh, wow. Yeah, that might not even be the real key for all we know. Let's just see what we have. Yoga? Ew. I don't want a yoga video. Uh, okay, yep, that's definitely the key. But what is it open? Yeah, we already did all the levels. We haven't done the second room, though. You're right, there's two rooms. Guys, come on. The second room. Part 10. All right, let's... Part 10. All right, let's go. What's going on here? Hmm. Get ready, because it's time for lunch. Cook correctly, and you'll be grateful a bunch. What does it mean by cook correctly? Also, there's four high chairs. So, does that mean we're the ones who have to eat? Well, you're the only ones who can fit inside them. Yeah, everyone go grab one. Okay. Um, these are very weird. Wait a second. What? All the food in the fridge all match up with the high chair colors. And same with these. So, whatever chair they're sitting in, we have to give them that color of food? Oh, wait. I guess so. I'll just grab a random one. Me too. Same. What's wrong with the yellow one? Okay. Looks like you're up first. Oh, no. Huh. Hope you like blueberries, because that's all there is. Oh, awesome. I love blueberries. All done. Perfect. Okay. Um, sugar, milk, and salt. And we have to use everything? Um, okay. Let's put the sugar on a plate. Put salt onto it, I guess. And then milk to drink. Here you go. Sugar and milk. Sugar and milk? Take it or leave it. Anything to get out of here. All right, time for the sugar. This should be good. Oh, what is this? Sorry. What did you do? It's salty sugar. Uh, looks like I'm next. Why are you holding that giant bowl? I don't know. This is the only option there was. Oh, great. A popsicle and mustard. Wonderful. Just open this and dress it. And serve it in a bowl, I guess. Here you go. Um, something's up with this. What did you do to it? If I tell you, you're not going to want to eat it. It doesn't matter if I want to or not. We have to get out of here. There's mustard on it. What the? Just eat it, Quinlan. I don't want to. Eat it. Okay. Ugh. That was terrible. Yeah, well, at least it's over. All right, your turn. Are you ready? I don't know about this. Well, you're going to have to be ready. Oh, no. He's not going to like this. Strawberry and apple. Chili pepper and ketchup. Oh, no. Put these two in first. Add the pepper. And then coat it all off. <sighs> Please don't hate me after this. Here you go. Oh, no. Oh my gosh, what is this? Ah! Ah! It's so hot. <sighs> Did you just try to poison me? No, I had to. Kind of glad I got mine now. Me too. Hey, look, the door's open though. Oh yeah, I call opening it. It's not a competition. Whatever, I want to open it. Hmm, 
I need three more plants that need to be planted. One of them might be enchanted. What is this, a fairy tale? Why are we in the jungle? Just plant something. How? Oh wait, there's a watering can. Maybe if I just go like, oh. Hey look, a flower grew. Okay, now plant the other ones. Okay. Another flower's growing. Last one. Why is nothing happening? Maybe you're not watering it good enough. Let me try. What the heck? Maybe there's no flower in there. Maybe there's- <gasps> The key! That's why it wasn't growing, it's because it's the next key. Oh. Well, come on, let's go. All right, next level, here we come. Part 11. Sorry it took so long, it was a very busy competition week. I won third place though, don't mind how awkward I look in that photo. Anyway, on with the video. Next level, here we come. Alrighty. Whoa, what's this place? I don't know. This is my room where I play and sleep. Find the last key for a memory to keep. What do they mean a memory to keep? Well, they also said last key, so maybe they mean this is all gonna be a memory after we're out. Oh yeah. Okay, let's find it. It's not under these clothes anywhere. I don't see it under the bed. Let me see. It's not in the drawers. It's not on the bed anywhere. Nothing under the blankets. Nothing under here. Nothing on the walls. Wait, we investigated the blankets, but not the pillows. What the? What's this? The pillow opens. Hang on, there's something inside. It's the last key. Yes, finally we can get out of here. Alrighty. Um, what's the deal here? I thought we were done. Yeah, what's all this? Maybe the note will help us. Congratulations, you're at the end. Rest up now and off you'll send. That makes no sense. Rest up now? Well, there's enough beds for us. I guess we just... Lie down? What's that gonna do, though? I don't know, but let's try. Okay, we're all ready. Let's rest up, I guess. I don't think anything's happening. Nothing seems to be happening. <gasps> what the? We're back? Guys, get up! Huh? Are we back? No way. We're back. We're literally back. Oh my gosh. You're joking, right? We're back? Huh? <laughs> yes, we did it! And no one went missing. And I'm never coming back here. Yeah, me too. What's all the jibber-jabber in here? Mr. Clipper, how could you do this to us? It's part of the camp. Be quiet. Anyways, get to sleep. Your parents are gonna come pick you up tomorrow morning. I thought they were coming at the end of the summer. Yeah, we just started. It's been like three days. It's been two months. School starts again next week. Huh? You're lying, right? We were not gone for two months. Uh, yeah, you were. You're crazy. Someone needs to shut this camp down. Well, they can't because no one will believe you. Anyway, go to bed. You guys are really annoying. Uh, that's really weird. How are we gone for a month? The next day. I'm so glad we're finally leaving this place. I know. Hello? Oh my gosh, Mom. Mom, get me out of here. Hey, kids. Did you guys have fun? No. Oh. Well, you can tell me about that at home. I wish I got to come with you guys. No, you do not. Oh. Okay. Well, let's go home, shall we? Yeah. Bye, guys. Bye. Lucky they get to escape before us. Why would she want to come to summer camp? Well, because she doesn't know what really happened. And Dad's never going to believe us. Hello? Oh my gosh, Mom. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Okay, calm down. Get me out of here. Okay, okay, I'm going. Bye, everybody. Bye. Later. Bye, guys. Well, everyone's gone. We just need Dad to come get us. I know. Hey, girls. Oh, thank goodness. Dad, get me out of here. Whoa. Let's go. Okay. Girls, what happened? They thought it was going to be hard telling him, because who would believe that whole story? But all they needed to say was the first part. Well, first he made us sleep in the woods by ourselves at night. Alone. Sleep away. The ending. He made us sleep by ourselves in the woods alone. What? And it was only the second night, too. We had, like, no twining or anything. He didn't even come with us, so tell us what to expect. And we met some girls who used to go to this camp, and they went missing a long time ago, and he didn't even bother to check. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay. Clearly, it was a mistake sending you here. Let's get you two home now. Yes, please. Later that day. Oh, those annoying kids are gone. And I still got paid this summer, even though I sent them away for two months. Mr. Clipper, you're so clever. I do this every summer. Mr. Clipper! Mr. Clipper, we know you're in there. Get out now! Um, hello? Mr. Clipper! Okay, I'm coming! Huh? Oh, no. Are you Mr. Clipper? Uh... No. Everyone knows who you are. Don't try lying to me. Okay, well, maybe I am, but who are you? I'm Officer Bradsley. Oh. In the past two hours, we have gotten numerous reports on your camp. And every single reporter had the same story. For the two months that the parents paid for, they weren't even in your camp. Because you sent them out into the woods. By themselves. With barely any supplies. And you didn't even tell them what to expect. No training either. Or something like that. Uh. Wasn't me. 
You're gonna have to save it for the judge. What? Come on. You guys are insane. I'd never do this. Well, all the parents and kids say otherwise. And in case you're wondering, they're getting their money back. That's not fair. We don't want to hear it. And so Mr. Clipper was thrown into jail. And his camp was shut down. Let me out. I can't hear you. Let me out. Hmm. Let me think about it. No. I shouldn't even be in here. The end. I hope you enjoyed that series. I don't know why I'm talking like this.